Welcome to 2209 Hanover, located in the Lake Park subdivision. You've got a beautiful brick home. It has a brand new roof just installed last week with architectural shingles. There's a little pan of the front yard. You've got some citrus trees in the front. Love this orange citrus tree here. And then there's blueberry bushes in the back. It's a corner alley lot here. It's located in Northwest Albany. Quick access to shopping, churches, schools, Lake Park School District. Let's take a look inside. Got a beautiful rocking chair front porch. Another look back at the street view here. Recently cut back some of the shrubbery that's gonna grow in beautifully. Freshly painted front door. Love the updated light fixtures. The exterior was painted in the last couple years as well. And you've got neutral, beautiful paint on the inside. Let's take a look. Here we are in the front entryway. To the right is the dining room area. In front of you is the family room. And then over to our left is the formal living room. This is such a great flexible space. You've got, you could use it as a home office. You could use it as a play space. If you really needed an extra bedroom, a third bedroom on the main level, this could be even a third bedroom and you could have an access here with access to the hall bath. So really just a flexible, large space um, that every family needs right now. Looking back towards the front foyer area and the front door, and going back toward the dining room, if the oak floors start here in the dining room, they're gorgeous and beautiful shape. You've got updated light fixtures throughout. A couple of them don't stay, but just updated as well. You've got shutters on the front windows, lots of great natural light, kind of a judge's panel detail with the chair railing here on the bottom. I love this light kind of gray blue color here into the kitchen. We've got a beautiful kitchen here with granite countertops. You've got white cabinetry that everybody loves. Beautiful updated lighting. You've got a great new faucet. Love the view from the kitchen sink here. You've got display cabinetry. You've got a small bar area. This is the kitchen you've been dreaming about. It does have a pantry here on the left side. Great pantry space. And then in front of us is the laundry room. This is the laundry room of, that is you've been dreaming about your whole life. You've got extra space here on the side. Um, previously they had a freezer here. It's a great mud binge area for kids. Um, you could even have a little desk in here if you needed a little work space. You've got plenty of room for side-by-side -side washer and dryer with storage above, and even some utility space here, and a large light and bright window that really lets all the light flood in there. I love the big case opening you have out into the family room. So it really has a nice flow through that space. You can see the breakfast bar here and the large breakfast area. You have a great, nice size table. And then look at this big picture window that frames this beautiful oak tree outside. Just so serene. It's like having a beautiful painting right out of your kitchen window. This is a door accessing out into the patio space. And then you've got additional storage um, here as well. And they kind of had it as a coat closet. Just off the back door area, you've got access out into the garage. The bonus space we'll see in a few minutes and a half bath. Before we head upstairs, we're gonna finish the downstairs first. This is the family room. Here's a great view of this family room space, large enough for multiple seating arrangements. Again, you've got the beautiful oak floors here, updated lighting, raised brick fireplace, does have gas logs, um, and you would just add to add your tank to it, but a lovely mantle here. And the view again, neutral paint colors, fresh, light and bright, access back to the front door. And then this is the staircase going to the upstairs bedroom. So you had one staircase off the kitchen to the bonus room, and then one staircase here as well. Next, we'll see the bedroom. This is a coat closet here behind the door as we move into the bedroom areas. Again, the hardwood floors run throughout this space as well. This is guest bedroom number one. Perfect downstairs space for a nursery or children. You've got a big closet there. Again, updated lighting. 
It does have access into the bathroom here. Um, so you have private access that goes back to the living room there. And then you've got kind of a landing zone here in the hallway. And then this is the guest bathroom on this side for that bedroom, which was once used as an office too. But you've got a single vanity with large countertop space here. This is like a cultured marble um, countertop here. And you've got a towel and tub um, shower combination with the privacy door here. And then that shows you the door accessing back into that bedroom. Next, we're gonna see the downstairs master suite. Here we are in the master suite. It's a nice large bedroom. You've got two big windows and then a lovely um, glass door looking out into the patio there. This bedroom has its own walk-in closet. With great storage. Again, lovely updated light fixtures and then a amazing bath space that was just updated. You've got marble countertops. Look at the cane back detail in this cabinet here. Um, you've got the shiplap as well. Chip and Joanna Gaines would be so proud. You've got updated lighting. It's just, I love how they did the sconce detail in here for an immediate update. No, you know, short soffits, beautifully done. And then you have a large garden tub shower combination that was also just redone as well. Also updated toilets. What a lovely master retreat. Next we're gonna head back up the stairs in the family room to the upstairs bedrooms. There are two bedrooms at the top of these stairs as well as a nice sitting area. This is the sitting room here at the top of the stairs. This flooring has been updated with a uh, luxury vinyl plank or LVP. What a great little bonus room area here. Kind of is a shared space between um, bedroom number three and bedroom number four and your bathroom here. So as we head into bedroom number four or three, excuse me, you'll see two great walk-in closets. So really, if you had the need, I mean, this could be a walk-through bedroom even because it does have two closets for these two rooms. Another walk-in closet, the storage. This is an attic access here. Great storage throughout this home. This is bedroom number three. Back through the shared space. This is a separate air conditioning unit up here. Then you have um, the full bath. Tub shower combination and then into bedroom number four. Love the room and shade detail here. Both of these bedrooms have walk-in closets, great storage. And what kid wouldn't want their own space tucked away upstairs? Next, we're gonna see the final bonus space above the garage off the kitchen. Here we back are back off the kitchen side. Um, this is brand new carpet here going up into the bonus room. This um, is separately heated and cool. You've got updated lighting here as well, but what a wonderful bonus space. I could see it as a homeschool room. I could see it with all the shelving here. I could see it as an exercise area, artist studio. The possibilities are endless. You've got great natural light with this large, um, sliding glass door overlooking the backyard space here. And then there's also attic access on the other side. If you need this for overflow guests, there's also the half bath at the bottom of the stairs. So it's a perfect overflow guest space as well. Next, we'll head outside. Here we are heading out into the patio. We've got a lovely fenced in backyard. You've got the nice privacy back here on the patio section. This door goes into the garage. We'll see that in a minute. Again, that has a brand new updated roof. Great play space. Here's another look at the back of the house here. And then over on the right side um, was a special little garden. Everybody had a quarantine garden. So you've got a lovely space to do raised garden beds here. 
another view of the backyard. That's the bonus space above the garage that we just saw. And you've got plenty of side yard out here I'll also show you as well. Here we are in the side yard, which is just additional great play space. They've got a basketball goal. The alley access comes around. Again, this is a kind of a corner lot here. Just a side view. I just wanted to give you a view of the garage, which is a nice, spacious two-car garage. Even the garage has been freshly painted, I feel like, and this home is immaculate. It is moved and ready. This is the storage room, which is also very spacious. We've got shelving, great storage. It was also painted. And again, that door goes into the backyard and that one goes inside the house. And then another lovely view of this yard. Look how expansive this front yard is and this magical tree here in the side yard. You've got the privacy of the lot on the left. Again, brick exterior, freshly painted, new roof. What more could you want? Welcome home.